Good morning, good morning, good morning, you lovely lot. It is Wednesday. It's getting so hard to get up in the morning. It's so cold and so dark. Just, just don't want to get up. Um, so Wednesday, the children will be here literally any minute now. Let's see if I can very quickly squeeze in today's advent. Oh, a bit more milk than that. Not a black tea, that. Don't do black tea. Only when absolutely necessary. Right, let's, let's do the door on my Yule calendar. So, number two is on the tree trunk next to the kingfisher. Ah, very nice. Oops. That looks like a nice glass of hot apple. Have that uh, at a nice Yule festival before. That was very tasty. Spiced apple. It says the first riser on Christmas Day should take a broom, open the front door and sweep trouble from the threshold. Ah, well, my boys are up early. Maybe I should tell them Christmas morning they have to do housework to get rid of trouble. I like that. They're always the first up, always have been. Although, to be fair, the night before Christmas, I always make sure the house is immaculate and spotless so that when we come down in the morning, it's perfect and you know i don't have to worry about dusting hoovering tidying it's just everything is beautiful when we come down in the morning so yes yeah, so there you go the first riser on christmas day should take the broom open the front door and sweep trouble from the threshold i should go put that back on my fridge okay time to go check that, well i need to go and put the extra heater on in the living room it's got a fan heater and it will blow all the hot air around the house a bit um, if it doesn't warm up, then the tumble dryer goes on down here. Yes, let's just go get the place warm. I'm so tired. Yeah. Is that in your shopping list, is it? Excellent. Pop it in your stocking then. Right then, Fin Fin. You pick one. See if it's on your Christmas list. Yeah. What is it? Uh, no, it's a dog toy. Show everybody and then put it back in the pile. I'm the other way round. Okay, well, Harvey's going to take it anyway. <laughs> Go on then, Harvey, your turn. You've got the dog, haven't you? Yay. That's it. Beth's turn. What is it? They both bad and Perfume. Is that on your oh, list? I barely <laughs> it is, isn't it? Yeah. So pop it in your stocking. You're picking lots of good ones. Right, Bethy Boo, go for it. Daddy, listen to this. The girls got what have you got, Beth? What you got? Roller skates? Uh oh. Roller skates. We don't need roller <laughs> skates. Right, which one are you going to pick then? Fim, um, what's your name? Ethan. Which one? That one? Go on then. Ooh, what's that? Oh, a dog bone. Do we have a dog bone on our list? I don't see a dog yeah. bone on our list. We're catching the post van today on our little walk. And I am just wrapping up a little Prezi. Actually, it's for Izzy. I saw it and thought of Izzy. Um, so, yes, I'm just packaging it up, ready to send off to them. If you don't know, that is Imo and Izzy Vlogs. I know some of you follow both of us. Um, so you will see me send it off and then you'll see them receive it, obviously. Um, but if you don't already follow them, go check them out. Imo and Izzy Vlogs. They're a really lovely mum and daughter crew. Um, Imo was uh, home editing Izzy for a long, long time, but Izzy has just started her um, her own personal adventure of starting at college. So, um, yes, it's a bit of a change for all of them this year, including the whole COVID thing, um, because Imo is a musician and obviously she hasn't been able to play. So, yes, it's been a, a big year of change for them all this year. Um, but I definitely recommend them. So yes, I'm going to post that off to them. And I've also got something for Camper Van Tales, which you guys all know, me and them are friends. And uh, definitely, if you haven't seen Darling Keith's channel and you like van life or you like dogs or you like hikes and exploring and a bit of history, then definitely check out Camper Van Tales because I have a present, that little one there, that Brendan wrapped up for me, which I need to post off to them as well. 
waiting for the van, aren't we? You're snuggled up nice and toasty. Waiting for the van. He'll be here soon. We have to be the first to spot him when he comes down the road. You want to see. You tell me when you see him, he'll be coming from that direction. F for Ethan. S for Sam. O for Ollie and O for Orion. L for... Oh, Llewellyn. M for... Mummy. My mummy. All mummies begin with M. M for mummy. My mummy. Yeah. Look, Ethan, that's F for Ethan. You're nice and snuggly in there, aren't you? You look like you're going to fall asleep. Off for Orion. Can you see off for Orion? Just there. That one. That's it. Off for Orion. There it is. It's sitting on the roof. Can you see it? Meow. You might need to walk back a bit, Finn. Walk up this way a bit so you can see it. I see it. It's a very now. pretty cat. I see it now. You can see it now. Pretty lights. What number can you see, Finn? Uh, what about this one over here? I like that one. Okay, a one and a one is... What comes after ten? We've just seen ten. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and eight, one. nine, ten, eleven. Eleven. It's eleven. We found the second Christmas picture, didn't we, that the school put up? Yeah, yeah we did. Got your hoodie down. Yeah. It all. Ethan has nearly eaten it all, haven't you? You nearly finished your sandwiches. Good boy. And how are you doing with your croissant? Uh, good. Good. And, oh, you've nearly eaten all your crackers. Okay, well, let's not empty all the crumbs out, love. Let's. Which? Hmm, that way up? I don't know. It was a nice walk we had. A bit chilly, but nice. Yeah, let's, let's not, thank you. Let's just leave it there. Good boy. Right, going to have some of your grapes as well, Ethan? <laughs> yeah, you're eating it all up, aren't you? Got zips? Nice. Yeah. Oh, I see. Put something in it and zip it up so it doesn't fall out. What's that? Christmas tree. What's that in? It's a Christmas tree. And this is another Christmas tree. It's got glitter in it. You shake it all the way down. It looks like it's got baubles on it and it's got a bingly bongly bell. Bits. It has got shiny bits. They're like baubles. Look, can you see? They ding, shine ding, in the light. Ding. Ding, ding, Christmas ding, tree. Ding, ding. Can you make this work, Ethan? Can you make the music sing? And me. Well, and then turn it round. I did it yesterday. You did do it yesterday, didn't you? Yeah. Takes a bit of practice, but you. Wow, you guys are good at this. That's it. So, this one smells of Christmas tree, and this one smells of berries, this one smells of cinnamon. You like the cinnamon one, do you? And this one smells of orange and spice. This is a cinnamon stick, this thing here. That's a cinnamon stick. You put it in cakes. Mm. Yeah, we don't put it in like that though. It has to be ground up into a tiny powder. But it's in a lot of Christmas cakes. So which one do you think smells the nicest? Do you have one that you prefer? No, the lid doesn't open. It's glued on. Because otherwise all the bits would fall out. Like. Christmas tree. You're making faces at yourself. Make a funny face then. Bleh. 
You do look funny. <laughs> you bumped your chin? Yeah. How did you do that? Outside. Oh dear. Tell me about your elf, because you were going to tell me about your elf. Did you have an elf come and visit your house? Yeah. Yeah? First, um, Hi, Orion. Ah. You come to sit with us? <laughs> what are you playing with? Ah. Orion's come to join us. Ethan likes you. <laughs> What's the matter? Ethan likes what? Someone can that. You can have that one if you like. There you go. Ooh, smells good, doesn't it? Which one do you like, Orion? Do you have a sniff? Sniff, sniff. Bumped it a bit. Hello. You're looking at you showing us your chin, are you? Your bump. I can bump my forehead. Is it okay now? Is it all better? Is it all better? No. It looks okay. It does look okay. Let's look snowflake. Snowflake. <laughs> what have you seen? Whoa. Oh, what have you seen? You can sit. Sit down with me. But my Ethan's head. He doesn't want to be squashed. You have to come and sit over here if you want to sit on me. Not on Ethan. Daddy on mommy. Well, Daddy's at work, isn't he? Where did Mummy go? Mummy took Rocco to the vets, didn't she? That's what you told me. That he went to the cat doctor about his haircut or his hiccups. I couldn't work out which. Was it haircut or hiccups? Haircut. Haircut, not his hiccups. Hiccups. <laughs> you got a cake there, Orion? Everything's going in the police station. You do like posting things, don't you? Will it fit through the door? Go on then, pop it in. They can all have cake. Cake in the station. That's it, through the door. Yum, yum. It's that time for dum -da -da -dum -dum -dum, the reveal of what is in the stocking. Last night, I asked you to put in your guesses in the comments, and we had Birdness58, Julia Prume, and Debbie Dusterhoff all thought it was the music box. I very nearly put the music box in there, but I didn't. Uh, Thrifty Grandma thinks a box of chocolates. You people who say chocolates, you see, you know the way I think. Uh, Ruth Gawthorpe thought it was Christmas lights, Imo. And also Rosie Grimstead thought it was a Christmas card. And Julie Pearson thought it was a squashed elf. Like squished in there, not a squashed elf. Let's see if anybody is right. It's a snowman. Sorry, no correct answers today. Wow, you've got a very tall snowman. It's like a three ball snowman, that one. Yeah, snowmen are three balls. Some of them are two balls and some of them are three balls. Um, if you're doing a picture, you need to come put your game away, mister, before I someone stands on it. I like oh, on the crack. Why are you excited, Kenzie? New season of Fortnite. New season of Fortnite. Yeah. Come on, come on. Yeah, this is the battle pass, but it shows all the skins and that. Oh, Yoda! Baby Yoda. What's his name? Uh, Grogu. Grogu, that's it. It's a trumpet, Sam. Southern fried chicken, vegetables, and chips, mm -hmm. and wraps. You're putting it all in wraps, are you? Nice. And Brendan hasn't got very much because he came in and went, I'm still so stuffed. So we've had to reduce his food a bit. Are you full up? Sorry. Just, just eat what you can no, manage. I'll have it. Nice. 
Just eat, eat what you can manage, because I know you fill yourself up, but please have some of the vegetables, because you can't just live off still, still. baguettes. What did you have in your baguette earlier? It was the baguettes, all those huge, giant, plate-sized rolls. Okay, what did you have? Chicken and bacon. Chicken and bacon, okay. You Could you at least eat some veg then for me? And then I'll be pleased just to... You pig! You found me eating that? I know, it's a bit dark in here. I had to show you all the snowmen pictures that the children have done this afternoon. Very cute. <laughs> Okay then, guinea pig. Potato first. Potato isn't good for us, is it? Gives us bad tummies. Bad tummies, but it's worth it occasionally. Mm. Leek. Leeks, mm. light leeks. Still a bit crunchy. No, the right side of cooked. Good. Not squidgy and horrible. Yeah. Nice. Mm. No. Good. Time to try. It's mashed with skin on as well, so it's not just, and it's cheesy mash. So this is chicken, cheesy mash, chicken and veg, with a red wine jus, jus of the red wine. Jus. Jus. It's that time of vlog again. What's in the stocking? What's in the stocking? And I'm giving you a clue. You may have heard that sound in the video today at some point. In the comments below, make your guesses. And we'll see if anyone's going to get it right. No one's got it right yet, two days in a row. Come on, people, before the end of Vlogmas, I'd like you all to have guessed correctly what's in the stocking. And on that note, I am going to go and have a shower, wash my scraggy hair, and make myself look slightly more presentable for tomorrow. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all tomorrow.